In this video, we're gonna talk about why CapCut is the best in terms of AI enhancing and upscaling. Let's jump in. All right, so there's tons of AI enhancing videos out there. There's a lot of services out there. There's some sponsored ones. And all of these are, I would say in terms of quality are good. I haven't tested all of them, but I would say they're, I've tried a few. I can't remember exactly which ones, but they all have, uh, you're paying almost by the minute or by the second of your video. Like for example, let me see if I can, this one is I think $300, which is not bad because you're not paying per video. There are upscalers. Um, let's see, let's look for the prices. Video AI enhancers, buy it now. One month plan, you buy the yearly plan, you're paying yearly. This one is 300. Actually these ones, the perpetual licenses aren't that bad, but there are upscalers that are enhancers that you're paying a lot more. You are paying, I believe you're paying, you're paying for the videos. For example, let's look at here. There, you get all these credits. See, there's credits here. You pay one credit. You could do 10 videos at once. And all these ones, they're, they're good. But I would say the number one, from my experience, has to be CapCut. Because the CapCut pricing is, is out of this world. CapCut pricing is, let's see, CapCut, the desktop version. Let's see the prices. I can't remember where the price is. But it's $10 a month. And there are so many features that you could do, especially when you're doing mobile. Uh, when you're doing like social media videos and stuff like that there's it's so much easier it's really it's a lot easier than after effects uh, yeah, easier than premiere the number one thing is the the price and the capabilities I'm trying to find the prices i can't remember yeah it's 9.99 a month you get 100 gigabytes of cloud storage which I don't, you don't need all that it unlocks all the pro features there are yeah, the AI enhancing feature here is no joke. It's so much better. Um, I would say, okay, here, so let's test it out. Okay, I, I opened CapCut and the, the UI looks very similar to After Effects or Premiere. And I'm gonna drag over a video and I try to find a web recording, like a copyright free web recording, but you can't find it anywhere. So I created my own and i'm gonna drag it over here this is a web recording that i did the audio is just gibberish i'm not really saying anything so let me just delete uh, or just silence the audio and you can see like the quality here is pretty blurry you can see that it's pretty blurry um not that bad but it's, you could tell that it's blurry now i'm gonna duplicate it and then do one right after and here i'm going to enhance the audio or enhance the video so you go to on the right side of the panel there's a video tab and go to the basic and there's a thing called enhance image and here you can see the enhanced image quality there's a percentage here there's a percentage here and it's enhancing the video automatically and this is basically doing the same thing that all these other websites are doing where you're paying for the upscale, you're paying, some of them you're paying by the minute or paying by the seconds. Let's see, I think this one too, you gotta pay um, pricing and a video. Let me upload my own video, okay? I'm gonna upload it here. And it's gonna do its thing, all right? Let's see the difference here. This is the AI Enhance from vMake AI. And then I'll go to the pricing features and see. I remember I checked this one out and the pricing was you're, you're paying by the second, I believe. All right, while this is loading, let's go back to CapCut. Here it is. Here is the old, the original version. You can see it looks, the resolution is kind of bad. And then here's the, um, the AI enhance. There, I mean, it's, you could tell that there's there has been some modifications done to the AI hands. 
Um, they're filling it in to make it more enhanced. But overall, I mean, the quality has gotten from between here to here. It's pretty noticeable in terms of the enhancement. Um, I mean, I think it looks like I got makeup on, but in terms of the AI enhance, it is, it did a pretty good job. All right, let's go back to the website here. Let's maximize the one from AI video enhance. Testing, testing. And right, this it, is a typical zoom video that it looks exactly the same. Testing, testing. Right, this is a typical zoom video that I think here it looks it looks like I have makeup on too. But see here it says credits. Every time you use it, you need to get credits. And if I go to the pricing plan, look at that. You're paying you're playing you're paying a lot more. And so my my overall pick here is definitely CapCut. I don't know why they yeah anyway by far the cheapest and it performs just as well as any of these sites that you see where there's like per credit uh, per credit pricing plans and the outcome is the same i highly recommend CapCut, especially with social media and TikTok and instagram all these things using vertical videos there's a lot of cool things that you can do in CapCut, especially when it comes to vertical form let me see if I can find some. I'm still getting used to uh, using CapCut. I'm not sure where the templates are. What? Oh, here it is, templates. All right, so here in the memes, like you can make your, if you got a, per, if you got a personal brand um, or if you're trying to promote, like for me, I have my own TikTok account um, related to instructional design. So I take these memes and I try to flip it so that it has some type of e-learning uh, material to it. But you know, there's all these memes and then it, you can just... And all you have to do is just replace the green screen uh, with whatever you want. And I forgot what this is. Learning CapCut, it will be definitely a beneficial thing to do. Even if you're in HR or you're in training and development, you could just send these out as you know funny things uh, in the email chain. Hope this helps. Um, ask away if you have any questions. All right, this is a typical Zoom video that um, you would see in meetings uh, in, at work. And this is me testing out the. Right, this is a typical Zoom video that um, you would see in meetings uh, in, at work. And this is me testing out the the visual and what it looks like before the audio was enhanced. <laughs> 